For part A, we need to sketch the graph y equal to cos 2x. Before we start sketching the curve, you have to do some analysis here. So you have cos 2x. This is actually your horizontal stretching that will change your period. Your period for cos 2x is 360 divided by 2. That is your period is 180. And then for cos 2x, your range is from the minimum value is minus 1 and the maximum value is 1. Now we start sketching y equal to cos 2x. First, you have your x-axis and the y-axis. The range you need is until 180 degree. Then you have a 90 degree here. 45 degree and 0 degree and here you have 135 degree so you must get the range correctly for x so this is the value you're supposed to put on your x-axis for y-axis you have the maximum value should be 1 and the minimum value for cos 2x is negative 1 so since the period is 180 degree you should expect one complete cycle in 180 degree for cos 2x start from 1 back to 0, then to 91, back to 0, to 1 again. So this is the graph for y equal cos 2x. You need to label your graph. So y equal to cos 2x. So you completed this part A. Now we move on to part B. For part B, we have to draw a suitable straight line to find the number solution for this equation. We have 2 cos square x equal to 2 minus x over 360 degree. First, we have to determine the suitable straight line. What you have to do now, you have to make one side of the equation here become cos 2x. So I have two cos square x here, so I'm looking at cos 2x formula. Remember, cos 2x formula, in terms of cos, you have 2 cos square x minus 1. So I need 2 cos square minus 1, one side there. What I'm going to do now is, first I copy down my 2 cos square x equal to 2 minus x over 360. Then I minus 1 on the left hand side and minus 1 on the right hand side. So now I have 2 cos square x minus 1. This is actually my cos 2x equal to 2 minus 1 is 1 minus x over 360. Now my left hand side is cos 2x. That is the trigonometric function that I just drawn. So the right hand side should be the straight line that I supposed to draw now. That is y equal to 1 minus x over 360 degree. To draw this straight line y equal to 1 minus x over 360 degree. I need at least two points because this is a straight line. So the first point here, I can substitute x equal to 0 degree. So when x equal to 0, my y equal to 1 minus 0 over 360 equal to 1 minus 0, which is 1. So the first point I have is 0, 1. The second point, you can either substitute 90 degree or 180 degree. Let's say I have x equal to 180 degree. So my y should be 1 minus 180 over 360 degree. I have 1 minus 0 0.5 equal to 0 0.5. So the second point here is 180, 0 0.5. Now I have two points. That is my 0, 1. 0, 1 is here. 180 degrees, 0 0.5, I have 180 here, 0 0.5 will be somewhere around here. So now I try to draw my straight line. And now I label my straight line. This is y equal to 1 minus x over 360 degree. So now I need to find the number solution. So I'm looking at the intersection point of y equal to cos 2x here and the straight line. That is one intersection point here and the other intersection point here. So my final answer that is, I have to write that, that is two solutions.